out here on patrol. Officer Hill. See that? A Hill. That's what they call me. Officer A Hill. I'm out here, you know what I'm saying? This is top flight parking services. One time I gave this dude a ticket and he saw that my name was A Hill. What's your name? We like, I need your name and badge number. I said, my name is A Hill, sir. That dude said, now you more like an a-hole. <laughs> he called me an a-hole. <laughs> Not a-hill. You're more like an a-hole is what you are. Yeah, but I'm out here patrolling. It's uh, March 24th, man. Man, this coronavirus is crazy, bro. I don't know. I usually don't buy into things too easily. But when I see a bunch of rich white people losing money, this affected a whole lot of people. But I'm still, I still don't know what's going on, really. I ain't gonna take it for face value of what they just saying, like, this is what it is, the coronavirus, this, you know what I'm saying? Rarely do they give you the 100% real through the news like you get it. I've learned that, so. Even though all the news channels got it and everybody this and everybody say that, I still know, I still believe that there's some people that know more than they let know. It's a ghost town though. All the parking lots empty. Yeah, man, Officer A Hill. AKA Officer A Hole, what the nigga call me. <laughs> I walk up on this one dude vehicle one day. Some dude comes up kind of with an aggressive tone in his voice. Can I help you? I ignore him. He hit me again. Can I help you with something? I tell him, no, thank you. <laughs> Real politely like. <laughs> I said, no, I got it. I need no help with this. It's free parking today. They don't know I ain't tripping. It's coronavirus day today. Free parking. I can't approach nobody. Everybody's sitting in their car. I have to practice social distancing. I'm going to socially distance my ass from all these motherfuckers. Yes, I am. Safety first. I don't want to put them in danger. Top flight parking. Officer A. Hill on duty. People don't understand, man, what it takes to be a top flight parking officer. See, in order to do it, you need two qualifications. You got to be front of the hood for one, and you got to really just have good common sense. Just have good common sense. And them the only two qualifications you hire. That's what got me the job. For example, there was a lady sitting in her vehicle illegally parked. Mind you, it's kind of late. I'm trying to go up to her and let her know, hey, man, you know, I'm the dude. I'm here to write the tickets. You might want to fix this problem. So as I'm walking up to her car, I said, excuse me, ma'am. Before I can get the words out, she going to hit me with the shh, shh. My baby, my baby sleep in the back. I tell her, oh, oh, okay. Okay. Then I tippy-toed back. I tippy-toed back to my, uh to my work truck to get my little ticket thing. <laughs> Wrote the ticket out back there real quietly and then came and tippy-toed back to the front and slithered it up under the windshield wiper just so gently, so softly. <laughs> and we start talking to the regular to like, what are you doing? I said, shh, the baby, the baby. Yeah, these motherfuckers is crazy out here. But yeah, man, that's what it takes. To be a top flight motherfucking officer. All right, good people. Aha! Aha!